Polly Popcorn, Polly Popcorn, do you rent or do you buy? He's the guy that will tell you why. Polly Popcorn at the movies. Hey, that's me. Hello, fellow filmmakers, it's me, Polly Popcorn. This is Carmela DeCorno, and to my right is David, the movie blogger, the world's worst movie critic. What? I'm not that bad. Yeah, if you don't believe me, go ahead and read his review of Insurgent in the comments section down below. We'll give you a moment to check it out. Was I right or was I right? And just remember, Carmella picked Insurgent to be the top dog winner last week. So David lost and now he she gets to shave off his beard later on in the show. Ah, I love my beard, no! <laughs> go ahead and click on the button to watch Top Dog if you want. All right. Let's go ahead and watch me rip apart David's uh, little horrible review. Oh, David, I can't wait. Why don't you uh, go ahead and give us a brief rundown of, uh, of Insurgent for us. Ah! Insurgent, the sequel to Divergent, is finally out. I've read all the books. I'm a huge Veronica Roth fan. I was first in line to go see this movie. I can't wait to talk about it. So, Insurgent takes place right after Divergent. Trish Shailene Woodley is um, with her group. They're on the run from attacking Janine's group, and they're trying not to get caught by the Dauntless soldiers, uh, and they're plotting their next move, basically to kill Janine. Janine, on the other hand, found this uh, ancient artifact that was created by the Founding Fathers. Um, it's supposed to have like some advice to help her like rule everyone. So the only way to open it is to go through all these virtual reality sequences, and the only person that can solve these sequences is a Divergent. So, come on, I think we all know who that is in the movie. No big surprise there. And that's pretty much the movie in a nutshell. Oh, yeah, fantastic. And uh, apparently you had a few problems with the, the pacing of this movie. Why don't you go ahead and uh, explain that from your little review that you wrote down below. Oh yeah, Insurgent actually has a little bit more action than Divergent, which is a good thing. So basically there's, you know, your basic shootouts and some like hand fighting, you know, your standard fare. But what I really liked were all the virtual reality sequences that were used uh, for Triss when she had to figure out how to open up the, uh, the artifact that Janine had found. And that, that, all that stuff is, is a lot of fun to watch. And I think that's probably like the best part of the movie. What I didn't like was like where they were always like slowing down the movie. They would like constantly do this to show how much Triss loved four, and it's like, yeah, we get it, but it was like, oh, four, I love you. Mm, oh, Triss, I love you too. Mm, huggy, huggy, kissy, kissy. We're young adults in a young adult movie. It's like, ah, oh, come on. Just get back to the action and the story. That's all we want to see. And in your review, you kept freaking talking about Kate Winslet and Titanic. What is all that about? Oh, I got to hear this one. I can't help it. Every time I see Kate Winslet in a movie, I immediately think of Titanic and say to myself, maybe Leonardo did survive. Maybe they will meet up sometime in the future. I really love that movie. It made me freaking cry. And I admit it. I'm a Kate Winslet fan. I'm a Titanic fan. And yes, I'm a Leonardo DiCaprio fan. Yeah, whatever. Anyways, you lost top dog. So that means Carmela gets to shave off your beard. Bye bye, weirdo with the beardo. We've had it with you. Carmella, you know what to do. Come on, David. Let's get this over with. All right, let's get some of this lather on you so we don't get some razor burn. Look really gross. It's more on this side. Okay, start shaving. Ah, oh, look at that. My God, what's this hair made out of? Steel wool? Okay, let's get some over here on this side. Let's get a few spots over here. Oh, yeah, looking really good. All right, so let's clean you off. Ooh, okay, let's dry you off real quick, and uh, we should be all set. Come on, David, don't forget how pretty you look. Oh my God! What, what did you do to my beard? Oh, nice job there, buddy. Eh, I won't worry about it too much. He's got a face only a mother can love. So what do we give Insurgent? We give it a rent. Yeah, we actually agree with David for once, and uh, he's right. It's marginally better than Divergent, and if you're a fan of the series, go ahead and check it out in the theater. But for anyone else, yeah, you're better off waiting for it to come out on TV. So, that's it from us.
Talk to you later, my fellow Filmigos. See you next month for our next review. And be sure to check out next week, Top Dog. And of course, subscribe. Just click on the little Polly Popcorn helmet somewhere in the corner. And always comment, like our videos, and uh, check us out whenever you want.